important for real estate for obvious reasons. And it's something that we that we tend to focus on. Um, I'll give you my thoughts here in a few, but I want to get to get your thoughts when it comes to financial priorities. If it's income, savings, the whole the list goes on spending, so on and so forth. Where do you rank credit in your book and from your perspective? Hmm, that's so funny. I don't know if I have a hard like number, but I would say pretty high. It would be one or two for me. One or two. Yeah, okay. definitely. Just because um, you just need credit to leverage uh, in so many different respects, in terms, especially on large purchases. Right. So like, you're not buying a house without credit, or you'd have to find a mortgage company that can manually un- underwrite. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's just imperative if you're going to buy a car or if you're going to buy a house or if you're going to buy a boat or if you're going to borrow against your house or business or, or, or a house to start a business rather, um, you just need credit flat out, you know? That makes sense. Um, what would you say to someone? I mean, like you would need a car, right? right. Like you need credit to get a car. No one's going to tell you really... Uh, well, unless you get like, I don't know, three or $4,000 car, if you can save up right, for right. it, right? Um, but other than that, like, how do you address, you know, savings or investing in those other areas? Like, how do you, how would you balance that? Um, I think I think it depends on the individual, and I think it depends on the individual's end goals, right? Mm-hmm. So I think you prioritize those things based on where you want to be in the past, or, or in the future, rather. I'm all over the place. It's <laughs> day quill. Um, <laughs> I should think be NyQuil that at this it point. should be night right. It should be Nyquil at this point. Um, I think that so we'll use a woman making forty five thousand dollars. Definitely not in New York City, but you know, in somewhere in the other forty nine states. Um, if her goal is to buy a house in ten years and retire with a million dollars, and her credit is messed up, I would probably have her um, give attention to her credit first, just because. Um, with a higher credit score, she'd be able to do more stuff, right? So, for example, um, I'd have her 